your entire team played dress up. <laughs> and I had to zoom in on the picture of the four of you guys going shirtless, tuxedoed, like Chippendale dancers. Yeah. Because at first I was like, now I know that Justin's in, in better shape than he was a few years ago. There's no way that's him. So when I, when you first that's look at it, you really that's not far off though, Chris. Like I got to tell you, I'm sure I'm not going to ask you to raise your shirt right now. I'll take your word okay. for it. Uh, he's <laughs> because two guys went real, two guys went prosthetic chest, and I was shocked that Bellinger was one of the prosthetics. Yeah. So you know, originally it was just me and Cody going to do this and Cody found these I don't know what he was looking for on the internet but like <laughs> unprompted he found these like body suits and was like dude check these out and I was like oh like we could be Chippendales for dress up and he's like yeah I'm in and clearly he didn't know what a chip I, it would have been you know Belly's probably at the age where Magic Mike would have made more sense to him than a yes. Chippendale so I was like, all right, Chippendales, we're in. I'm going to order the suits. I'll order the tie or the bow ties and the cufflinks, and we'll be good to go. And I think there was some confusion because when I said Chippendales, he was thinking Chip and Dale, the chipmunks. <laughs> and he was trying to figure out why we had cufflinks and bow ties if we were dressing up as chipmunks. And I actually even showed him the picture, right? I'm like, hey, look, like, here we go. Chippendales and I, I probably should have said like I said Magic Mike and that would have made more sense to him uh, but yeah there was some confusion there and then with Joey Joey was actually I'm, I'm sure it's it's well documented him and Hans are like best friends and they were going to be Power Rangers together and Joey's Power Ranger outfit for whatever reason didn't show up on time mm. so he didn't have anything to wear uh, and I ordered extra an extra bow tie and extra cufflinks like knowing that there might be a couple guys that didn't have a, a costume. And then Dre got called up the day before. So obviously he didn't have time to get anything. So that's why they're all natural. And we went with the, uh, the body suit, by the way, those, those rubber suits are like, they weigh like 30 pounds. They're heavy. No, they shit. Don't. Yeah. And it took me, we got into Arizona. I went to my hotel room and it took me about 45 minutes <laughs> trying to get that thing off because it is so tight and so heavy. Like I was like wrestling myself on the bed in the hotel room, trying to get that suit off. And I wish there was a camera in there. So you guys, so I had the footage of it, but it was, I was gassed. I was spent. It was like a 45 minute wrestling match with myself. <laughs> Dude, what do, I mean, what do you do eventually? Do you have to cut yourself out of it? Get, use the jaws of life. That thing was like $200. I'm not cutting it out. I still have it. I'm keeping it. It's hanging in my closet right now. I, I've seen what you made. You could lo you could lose the two hundred. Not it doesn't work like that, Chris. <laughs> That's how rich people stay rich. They yeah. use their body suits. I can't believe I spent two hundred dollars on that damn thing. <laughs> um, I don't know which. Uh, I think my favorite outfit outside of that one was Mookie and Freddie going as Tiger and Stevie Williams. Yeah, that was classic. That was a classic one. Freddie, Freddie actually had like a custom stevie williams like caddy suit with like the number five on and mookie was like tiger to a t so it, that was good and then they had the little plastic golf clubs <laughs> golf set, which i thought was a nice touch but yeah uh, the sneaky one for me was was heaney the dr pepper guy with the oh one. yes and then he even like got on the ground and like posed and like yeah that was a sneaky good one good effort by the dodgers very yeah. good effort we actually um, had a trainer, our trainer was Connor McGregor, and he oh, did yes, all, I the, saw. all the tattoos, and he had the flag, and like I thought that was a good one too. Thomas, did he did he beat, did he beat the shit out of your bus just to make it real life? He didn't throw any rails through the windows or anything, so it wasn't <laughs> he didn't quite like like act it out a hundred percent, but uh, he looked the part at least. 